guys, this is Bree. And this is Angie. And, and this, this is the Twinsy Talk, Talk Show. So today we're doing a really, really exciting episode. Today we're going to be doing fake surgery, surgery on um, stuffed a stuffed animal. Yeah. So yeah, um, let's get started. We'll see you in a second. Just a moment. Bye! Bye. Uh, we're starting off with our bunny rabbit. He has a sad cut right here. It's a wound. It's a horrible wound. So, so we're going to put on this little thing with the little slit so we can just quickly just put it over the head. Put it over under, the head. And then have the hole right there where the wound is. The wound. The wound wound. It's the same thing. So first thing, we're just to make sure it's healthy, we're going to use this. Check the nose. Okay. Clear nose. I'm gonna check the eyes. Fur covers the eyes. Okay. Seems clear. Let's now check ears. The ears. This is really not stable. Okay. Ears seem pretty good. Ears are good. Okay, so what we're gonna do. So we're gonna alcohol, alcohol. We're gonna clean. We're gonna the clean wound. it because it was bleeding. As the patient, so we're said. going to take this off so that you can do it all around. So what we're gonna do is first we're gonna just go inside and just pat it gently, and then they're gonna just clean it off, and then we're gonna just clean around. Just so no germs or bacteria gets in. Just oh my god, it smells like alcohol swabs right now. Alcohol swabs. Okay, so that's done. I have another one for after the procedure. Okay, so let's get this on with. Um, so what we have is our scissors, our very sharp scissors, our fabric scissors for like anything that we might need to use it for. We have the needle and thread. We try to get the the color, color that's the closest. Let me just make sure you, this not works because we didn't test it out. No, I already tested it. Oh. I tested it. Already. Okay, I so. I triple knotted it. Here, this is the color. This is like an orangish. No, you do this. Oh, as you do it against It's an something. orangish. My hand is really red for some reason. It's like an orange tan. Yeah, All right, out, right, so let's. Sorry, there we have lots of patients coming in, so let's okay. do this. So, um, I open this a little, but for the procedure, we might take it off. Yeah, we're because gonna... it's easier to um use work with. Yeah, so we put this patient to sleep, so they don't feel they won't any... be feeling all the stitches that really they won't feel the stitches going through their body. So I'm just gonna. I already checked it. It will gently tug on it just to make sure it um, will. It's tight. It is very firm and tight. I'm gonna do that again. If it's not perfect, that's fine. I'm not the best person at sewing everything, so. That's why we're not real surgeons. Yeah, that's why it's a fake surgery. If I was doing it on a person, I would definitely fail. See, it's already closing in at the top. So, like, you don't need so much, actually. Just. But we just put a lot just in case. Yeah, you just want to be, you want to be safe. Because that looks okay. like you need a lot on it. I'm just going to. Looks like you need a lot, but you really don't. So, I'm just going to continue. So, we'll be back when she's almost done, Okay. Bye. Say bye. Bye. I'm just about finished. Like one stitch left to do. Yeah, I don't know how well you can see, but there's like one teeny hole. So the point of doing this was it's kind of ish real, kind of ish. Kind of real. So what this whole backstory line was is that um, if we didn't close it up quick enough. That it would go through the intestine. That is the storyline that um, 
so they hurt themselves and it got a big cut down so um if we didn't cut it down early enough or quick enough um they would die lo losing so much blood so they would get dizzy and for losing so much blood and they would also just die because of it might rip through their intestine so that's okay what, we're gonna check that's the main reason why i'm doing that i'm just gonna quickly i'm gonna quickly just there tightened it loose mm -hmm. seems good and then okay, i'm gonna use these yeah, yeah, yeah. i need to do this um There's Okay, now I will just tie it at the end. Be careful with the needle, it's pointy. So what she's doing is she's just trying, trying to tie it off, which is really hard. And remember that alcohol swab that we had another one of? We're gonna we used the, the first one. It's right down there. I don't know where it went, but now we're going to use um, the second alcohol swab. So you're only going to need two. Yeah, just two. Two alcohol swabs. Two. This is like the best thing to do when you're bored, by the way. So, like, if you ever feel really bored. We just had to make a video. So, this is what we did. Just like cut a stuffed animal. If you don't have a dog to break it for themselves. Yeah, blow. So I cut it with my scissors. That's what the fabric scissors were for. Cutting it open. Fabric scissors. They're very sharp. This is really hard. We'll just skip ahead of the video once she just finally did that. So, bye! Okay, sorry about the noises that I made because... Yeah, I was in a really, really awkward position. So she's just making sure that um, Cleaning she it just off. cleans it off just in case if there's any bacteria trying to come in, any germs. So here, um, after that, we're going to just do a quick double check. Yeah, and then she's going to clean it a little bit. Okay. I'm just doing a little clean off before she does clean, the actual cleaning. So... Me to use no, hold okay. this. It's okay. Okay, so so I'm just quickly I'm gonna put that down and just I'll hold this. No, I know okay. you need it. Quickly, I'm gonna use this. Quickly check all the areas just to make sure no ripped areas in the intestines. Quick looking, you know. You, I'll show this view of the stitch. I don't know how well you can see it, but yeah, you can see it. That's the that's the stitch pretty much there. That's the color of the stitch. You can barely see it. Look, this is how it looks from the outside of you. You can barely see the stitch. So then it is like so hard to see. I'm gonna quickly just use this alcohol swab just to make sure one last time. It's never good enough just to make sure our patient is. Perfectly clean after a surgery because you know you never know if there's germs on the tool that we used. So I'm just gently pushing down just to put the stitches in place while I just quickly rub it. Just rub it around too because you never know. And then so um. We'll show you right after when the patient just woke up. So we'll see you in just a bit. Bye. Bye. The patient just woke up and has their clothes on and ready. Yay! They feel so much better. Okay, so we'll put. She'll get back. No, she's too weak to walk. So we have to. She's too weak to walk. So I have to carry her into because she can't walk with her stomach. She's on her little wheelchair. This is an American girl doll wheelchair. So. 
That was the best that we can go with. Um, so yeah. That we'll take her back. You can come with, um, we'll show you. We'll just have her come and show. Yeah, so. Alright, so, see you next time. No. So, yeah, this is pretty much our little thing and how we did it. So, she wanted a little push, so, I mean, he wanted a little push, so. Alright, so this might be Come, too come this way. We'll go through the dark, dark, dark place. Quickly. And go through the area where it gets to go back to its original home. So I think that's going to be the end. So I hope you... Come, 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 come. We'll come over. So... Okay. Hope you enjoyed this episode of uh, Fake Surgery. So <laughs> Yeah, it was really fun to do. Yeah. And there's a so, lot of work also. Yeah, so. a lot of sewing. So, if you want to try this out for yourself, if you want to try this out for yourself. That way, baby, that way. If the you want to try this out for yourself, um, just do the stuff that we do. Maybe do even more stuff we do. Like, we didn't have everything. We wanted to do the glove thing where you, like... Yeah. Like, and let go. And then, like, yeah, it looks so cool. But yeah, but we didn't, we didn't have, have it. gloves. So, uh, we just want be creative. Be really creative. On do what you want to do. Add some more. Take some out. Do whatever you want. It's all Does up to really you. Does it really matter? Ask an adult for their sewing, their sewing kit or sewing machine. I... Sewing kit. Just needle. Okay. Not the sewing machine. Yeah. Very good. So, we'll see you later and... Bye, I guess. Bye. Bye. Thank that you. That way, baby. Baby, you look that way. Thank you for helping me. Bye.